Man, that ain't Pokemon, that's Yu-Gi-Oh, though. Oh my god, how could you say that it's Yu-Gi-Oh when it's Digimon? Oh my god, how could you say that it's Digimon when it's Aguchard? Ha <laughs> ha, Charizard. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to Super Smash Brother. Today, we are going to be doing Classic Mode with Little Mac. As last time, I asked you guys if you wanted to see Palutina or Little Mac next. And it looks like the Mac and Cheese... Why did I say Mac and Cheese? <laughs> I guess because his name is Little Mac. Either way, he won by just a little bit. And next time, we'll be doing Palutina, which I'm not really looking forward to because I have no idea how to play Palutina. So I'm going to definitely practice up. However, Little Mac on the other boxing glove i have played quite a lot of him he's really really fun to play uh if you guys don't know he's a ground character so basically he's really bad when he's knocked up into the air like his attacks do really little damage and he just really does not have very good air attacks but he's really really strong on the ground so we're gonna check him out we're actually gonna try out one of the other alternate modes aside from classic mode today we are gonna do the punching bag mode which is one of the other alternate ones and i guess there's three different modes in here actually i know that this is the home run mode where you try and launch the punching bag as far as you can i have no idea what this one is and i i guess this one has something to do with uh, knocking out me fighters out of the field so we could try this one out as well as do the classic mode but i wanted to try out something different today so let's go into home run mode or whatever the announcer just said and go ahead and pick our boy little mac but yeah i was just saying how i'll do more stuff once the english game releases and that is actually coming up very very soon the english version of this game is coming out i believe on the 3rd of october so if you guys have been waiting to go ahead and play the games yourselves Fret not, it is coming very soon, and I wanted to ask you guys today in the comments what kind of stuff you would like to see once that version comes out, because I was thinking of doing a lot more uh, stuff versus people, because right now playing on the Japanese servers, oh man, we gotta hit this thing! Little Mac did not do very much, huh? Oh, we're supposed to weaken the sandbag. Hmm. Well, I guess I did that wrong. <laughs> we literally got a zero. Let's try that again. But yeah, I want to see uh, what kind of stuff you guys would like to see. I'm definitely going to do more battles against other people uh, because right now the Japanese servers are a little bit laggy. So now let's grab the boxing, the home run bat. I keep getting the names of everything wrong. But yeah, the servers aren't that reliable is what I was trying to say. And there we go. That's the home run mode. We got 293 meters, which is the new record. And I guess we can also download it. All right, sure. Why not? Put it on the SD card, man. Save that result. Share it with all them Japaneseies. I'm pretty sure the Japanese players of this game have gone way, way higher than that. And I'll be nowhere near the top. But, you know, it was worth a try, man. It was worth a try. But Little Mac has really strong uh, moves just on the ground. Does a lot of damage and has really good knockback. So I want to try this again, actually, because I want to try his charge up punch. His neutral special attack. So just pushing the B button is a really, really strong, like, uh... It's a move that basically, it does a lot. You'll see it. So this is what happens when you push B, and then he just punches it on his own. But I guess it doesn't knock the bag out of the air or out of the field unless you use the bat. So that kind of sucks. Let's try this one more time. I really like that move, though. In an actual smash contest, like, it can do a lot of damage. Uh, okay, hold on. We gotta grab the bat. Oh, no! That's the wrong way! Oh, there we go. I doubt we'll get it, fa like, farther away than last time because it was closer to the other thing but hey it hit the ground and something happened not a new record but we did get a custom move that's not, i think that's a custom move for a little mac awesome what does this button do i want to check it out maybe it shows us our like stats and our records and stuff like that that's what i'm assuming it is since it's got like a kind of like a profile thing or just change your character I guess. I don't know. Either way, uh, we will definitely try these out in some other episode. Let me know which one you guys would like to see as well as what this is because I have no idea. Anyway, we are going to do uh, Classic Mode with Little Mac. And I am pretty excited to do this, but at the same time, I'm kind of nervous because I mentioned... Oh, we've actually done it on 6.5. So I guess we'll try out 7 again. Basically, I tried to do 7 and I actually lost to Master Hand. And that's what I'm nervous about because as Little Mac... I mentioned a couple of times that his aerial attacks are not very good. And guess who's always in the air? That's right, Master Hand and Crazy Hand. So, not very fun to fight. Uh, I, I don't know how we'll do. But, I mean, before we get there, we have to fight Sonic and his friends. So, alright. We're off to a great start. I actually haven't played this game in a little bit. So, I might be a little bit rusty. But it's okay, because we play Little Mac. And that's not what I meant to do. Ah, there we go. 
He's got really cool attacks, though. I'll try to show them off. Uh, not really against Sonic here, because it's the one-on-one, -on -one, but later on when it's a little bit easier. Hey, we'll just try and use some items here. Take that, Pokeball. Oh, no, it's Electrode. He's going to explode. Sonic, get over there. Nah, he doesn't want to. All right, but yeah, this attack here can be really, really weird. It's his uh, side special. If you're playing on a Final Destination type of stage, that thing can literally just, like, launch you off of the stage. So you got to be careful when using that. You also have to be careful when the... Oh, no! When they have that attack because it can knock you all the way off. And now I got to get the star. Yes, we got it. Oh, oh we actually hit him with it. Nice. Gotta be really careful with that thing. It's basically like the ship from Kirby, but it's a new one that they introduced, and it's a gun, and it's basically like Mario's Final Smash, or any of those where it tries to push you off the edge of the screen. So it's kind of like uh, Wii Fit Trainers as well, I guess. There's a couple of other characters that have similar ones. Let's fight a sword character. All right, looks like Lucina is gonna join us to battle her two brothers here. I still don't get why the heck they added Lucina. I think... I mean, I like Lucina because I like that Fire Emblem game, but I guess it's more of a question of why wasn't Krom in it, I guess, because I don't know. I like them both, but yeah, this attack here can be really annoying if you use it at the edge of the screen. You can actually fall off the screen, and I'm going to show that off later if we get a chance. Uh-oh. Gotta watch out for that thing. All right. Ike almost got knocked out there. Ooh, good punch, but it didn't really knock anyone out or anything, so whatever. Uh, we got to put out more damage, though, instead of trying to go for smash attacks right off the bat. But yeah, this attack here, pretty good as well for knocking people out. And it actually stops you if you're at the edge of the screen. So even if you charge it up all the way, you can't fall off the screen with that one. But you can fall off the screen with this one here. So you saw there, I almost fell off the screen. A lot of people, like, accidentally do that. So I'm just trying to let you guys know, once you get the game yourselves, don't try to use that attack too often, especially if you're playing in a Final Destination type of stage, because you will uh, knock yourself out pretty easily. Oh my gosh. All right. Ike is the only one left here. I kind of want to knock him out with this move here. See if he walks into it. Oh man, he like narrowly dodged it, man. I love taking people out with that attack, though. It's like the most fun thing ever. Take a Pokeball, though, man. Ooh, a nice Oshawott. I didn't know Oshawott was in this game. What the? Oh, I thought we got knocked out, and then I realized that was Oshawott. All right. Well, Ike somehow lost anyway, so that's cool. And we just got a ton of items for him. Interesting. Those aren't items. Those are Smash Runs items. Like, you can use them to power up your character. Again, that's stuff that I'm going to show off more in the English release because, like, I can't understand the item description. So I didn't really want to do too much about it. But Smash Run is a really fun mode. So I really want to do some, like, multiplayer Smash Runs. You can't do it online, unfortunately, but... Okay, I have some friends that are going to come over for the uh, NA release of the game. So we'll definitely do some Smash Run for you guys. And it will probably be on the Pack channel. So if you haven't checked that out, uh, once we do get that going, I'll definitely link you guys the channel again for those of you that haven't seen it. But we have like a multiplayer gaming channel. And we're probably going to do a lot of Smash Run on there. Since for whatever reason, they decided to make it only be local uh, co-op, multiplayer, whatever you like to call it. I don't know. I guess it can either be co-op or multiplayer. Goodbye, Captain Falcon. Man, I love Little Mac, though. He's so cool. One of my favorite characters, but there are a lot of characters in this game that can knock you up into the air, and in the air, Little Mac is just not very good if you end up ever getting pushed off of the stage or fall off, rather, I guess. Basically, if you have to recover. His recoveries are so bad. So, yeah, there's a lot of downsides to him, I guess. He's really good on the ground, though. He can definitely just destroy... Um, I was playing, it was actually quite a long time ago, actually, now that I think about it, it was maybe like, oh gosh, well, as I say that, we already fell, and we have no, rec I don't know what the heck happened there, I just, I didn't even get a chance to recover, or even show off that, oh no, again, please don't lose, okay, I guess I could have recovered, I'm just bad, but anyway, um, I played some 2v2s on, oh no, 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 what the heck, I didn't even get a chance, I don't know why I kept falling in the water there. That was just really, really bad. I guess I was trying to show off that he has bad recoveries, but I didn't even use my recoveries, so... I'm not even going to blame myself for that, because I don't know what the heck just happened, so I'm sorry. I really... I don't even know, man. The first time, we just kind of let ourselves get chomped up by the fish. Then the second time, I, I just went right through the platform. So my bad, guys. Hopefully now we don't suck. But anyway, what I was trying to say about Little Mac here... Wait, what was I even trying to say? I don't even remember now. Because I was trying to say something like... 
I don't even know if it was about Little Mac. Let's get that blue shell, though. Please give me the blue shell. No, Zelda! No, we gotta jump, jump, jump! Oh my gosh. Oh no, this blue shell is totally after me. Totally after me, but we're gonna have it hit someone else. Didn't hit anyone, actually. Come on, Fox. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's concentrate for this level, because I'm actually having a pretty tough time. As I say that, I died again. Um, if you guys saw, the, saw it there, it was for like a split second. The more hits you get on Little Mac, like the more times you hit your opponents, you charge up this meter. And if you charge it all the way up, you get this move that can instant KO people. I think if they're like above 30% or something like that. It is really, really strong and all you have to do is press the B button once. And you can basically one-shot people. We gotta get that star, man. Oh no, that's not the star. Here's the star. Let's get Zelda. Oh, we almost got her. <gasps> hey, we got this final smash. Oh my gosh, I haven't actually gotten a final... No. Give me the smash ball, Fox. Gosh darn it. Fox got the freaking final smash. Now he's got his ship. Hopefully it falls in the river. Because that would be awesome if it did. All right. No. Oh my gosh. You got to be kidding me. This is a screen I see far too often. I don't even... Like, I honestly have never lost his little mech. Uh, unless it is against Master Hand. Is, it, is that even his name? What the heck? This stage has a reskin? That's cool. I think this is a balloon fight stage is what it's called. Um, it's a really old school game. I've actually played it at the arcade. Back when I lived in Orlando, there was this like arcade. We actually played it there. So that's pretty cool. A stage that I recognize from like a retro game. But anyway, uh, what I was saying is I have honestly never lost as Little Mac except to Master Hand, at least in classic mode, even on seven difficulty or intensity or whatever. So I don't know, man. I'm sorry about this. Uh Oh, I thought we got knocked out again. I was going to be very, very sad. Come on. Come on. No, what the heck, man? All right. That was just... Don't fall in the river, man. Oh, as I say that again, we fall in the river. What the heck did I just pick up? I, th I guess that's a part of the... The gun thing. Oh, no. Please don't fall in the lake. Oh, my gosh. Just get over here, Wii Fit Trainer. Please, stop. Just let me hit you. Oh, my goodness. All right. All right, Wii Fit Trainer, can you... I think we can actually walk to the other side of the stage. Here we go. Pick up a nice little gun. I don't want this gun, though. I forgot how to drop items. All right. I guess we won. Cool. Even though we lost twice, and I feel really dumb because we died in really dumb ways. <sighs> but we finally did it, guys. There we go. Little Mac has won. Hopefully now we don't lose against Master Hand because we're already down to six intensity, which is pretty bad already. Like I said, I've only ever lost to Master Hand, and it's because he's so bad at hitting Master Hand. But the last time I battled him, actually, it wasn't that bad because I mostly used this move here. Hey, look, we're battling the army of Sully's and myself, and maybe even a little bit of Ugo. But yeah, Little Mac on this stage is really good because you can just charge this up, and me's go flying off. Basically all of... Oh my... What the... All right, here we get to show off how bad his air is. Probably could have saved myself if I used maybe the side smash or the side special there instead of the down one. What the heck, man? All right, let me focus up because I do not want to lose again. We've been doing pretty bad. I'm really bad at hitting smash attacks because it's the same button as for hitting the, the tilts. Sometimes I'll end up hitting a tilt instead of a smash when I want to hit a smash, obviously. But it doesn't matter when the me fighters are literally just <laughs> running into you and killing themselves, but... Alright, we got to show off Little Mac's uh, recovery game there. You saw, he literally barely gets any air when you use his uh, up special. His side special can be good for getting back on the stage. I'm pretty sure if I used it there, I would have gone back. Um, let's just, you know what, let's go for it. Why the heck not? We've already lost twice. We might as well go crazy mode with crazy hand and see if we can do it. Even though I've never beaten both of them with Little Mac or beat, is it beaten or beat? I think it's just beat. I don't think beaten is a word. Maybe beaten is a word, but it's like when you beat eggs. Like, you, you want them eggs be beated, boy? Like, uh, I don't even know what I'm saying, man. Want some scrambled eggs? Gotta beat them up. But yeah, you can see there. Look at how little damage he does. Oh, no, we're being hit by their balls. And here comes the big ball. Ah! All right. But you can see there. He literally barely does any damage, like, when you try to hit them in the air. And now we've been grabbed up. Ah, I want to see exactly how much percentage we're doing. Look at that. One hit. Did about 10%, and there we go, we got two good hits. So basically, the way you want to do this is try to hit them when they're doing that. Like, basically, whenever they do 
end up on the ground, you want to hit them as much as you can, because that's when you really get your good damage in on them with Little Mac. Otherwise, when you're in the air, you're not going to get anything. Maybe that attack can be okay. But guess what? We actually managed to take out Master Hand in the time that we're supposed to in order to get Crazy Hand to explode into his second form. Which is good, because Little Mac is actually pretty good for fighting this guy, at least. All we have to do is avoid that. And we've actually got our Super KO Punch! If that was a regular character, we would have KO'd him. But because it is this guy, we don't really destroy him. Uh, we just do a lot of damage to him, though. Oh, no! Ah, see, that thing can be pretty good for recovery. Not if you get hit right immediately after again, though. Alright. This guy should be pretty easy. Oh, no, no, no! Come on, Little Mac. Come on, Little Mac! Reach the edge! Oh, my gosh, we actually reached the edge. That was pretty lucky there. I think we can actually do this. Yeah, there we go. There goes the first form. Unfortunately, sword form is not going to be as easy to handle because, again, this one is one that is mostly in the air. So we're going to do, like, no damage to this guy ever. So I guess we just have to hope for a miracle here. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, my gosh. Two saves with Little Max so far. Even though I keep saying how hard he is to recover with. Ah, oh, there it goes. We're done. Okay, we still have one more life, though. I probably should have stayed up in the air during that part there because I don't want this sword to hit me. Oh, we could have gotten way more hits on him there. All right, man. If we can take out the sword form, the last form should be really easy, honestly, because we just fight a mere little Mac, and he should not be difficult at all to defeat, honestly. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, man. All right. Come on, man. Just got to believe in ourselves, guys, because if we lose this, we have to do the whole thing over again. Actually, I think if we lose this, we get to fight him uh, starting off from the sword form. Like, you don't have to battle. Oh, man, I thought we got him there because it made, like, a special kind of noise. I don't know. That was weird. Oh, man, not again. No, 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 little Mac. Come on, survive. I will survive. I don't know the song. I guess we got the hit on him there. Did we? I don't even know, man. We're done for. This is going to kill us, though, unless we manage to dodge it. Oh, we didn't dodge it. No. Uh, the amount of times we've lost with little Mac today is just way too high, man. Way too high. There must be so many people disappointed with this video, but you know what? I've kind of given up at this point. It's just all about the fun, man. I like this game a lot, and I don't care if I'm not good at it. If you want to watch some good people, you know, there's plenty of them out there. Actually, I'm not sure about that, but you know what? I'm not one of them, and honestly, at this point, it's okay, because I'm just trying to have fun, man. So let's see if we can beat Master Hand this time. Just dodge that big old ball. What the? Okay. The barrage of big balls this time. I don't know why he threw so many big balls that time. But anyway, I really want to beat uh, the Master Core with him. Gosh, it's just so hard. There we go. Took him out again. You know what? That attack actually does really good damage. Maybe that's a good alternative to hitting people in the air. But I think since we lost, it's going to go straight to sword form. Yeah. So yeah, if you lose and you already took out one of the forms, it'll go straight to the one that you already defeated. So for me, since we defeated the doggy form already, the nine-tailed fox, the Naruto form, we're now going to fight uh, Sword Buddy. I don't even know what his name is, but yeah. We just got to make sure to dodge the final slice, which is this one. Oh my gosh, we actually dodged it. Man, if we'd been able to do that last time, we might have been able to pull off the upset victory. I mean, upset because I honestly expected... Ooh, there we go. The big old punch there. Man, the, the music even stops because they know that's a powerful punch there. They even stop the music. It's like Rihanna, man. Where's Rihanna up in here? Little Mac, is that? Are you hiding Rihanna under that hoodie, man? Because she's about stopping the music. I mean, I guess the joke was already obvious, but for some reason, I always like to emphasize jokes that are already obvious. Can we dodge it again? Ooh, nice. I think we just blocked it that time. We didn't even dodge it. Ooh, all right. We took out the sword form. The final form is coming out. Here it is, guys. And we immediately get knocked out by it. Can we reach it? No. <laughs> oh, man. This sucks. All right. Well, it's the one-on-one -on -one now. We just literally punched a wall right there. But I don't know. I think we're, if there's any character where we can literally, like, defeat him by not knocking him out, it'll be against Little Mac. Oh, my gosh. Come on. By that, I mean is, like, you don't actually have to take this guy off of the stage. Like, you don't have to knock him out. You can just uh, beat him by getting his percentage low enough. Of course, that's not going to happen if we get beat up like we're getting beat up. Oh, my gosh. Can we please? There we go. Oh, my gosh. We missed it. No. Oh, did he just kill himself? No, he didn't just kill himself. Oh, no. <laughs> totally missed that there. 
That sucks, man. Oh my gosh. Please. Why did the music just stop? I'm scared. Stop. I don't want the music to stop. Rihanna, no. Rihanna, please stop this. Stop this nonsense. No, don't stop it, actually. That makes me too tense when you stop the music like that. Oh, man. If we would have hit that. All right. All right. All right. No, 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 no. Come on, little Mac, man. No! Are we... We lost again. I said, man, I'm putting up my gloves. I've legit... This is the worst I've ever done at this game. <laughs> oh, man. Come on, little Mac. Make it back. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no! <laughs> I can't do it anymore. Just... Thank you guys for watching next time, The Revenge of Little Mac. It's gonna be like Rocky. Rocky got his butt kicked and then he came back and, you know, I don't think I've ever actually seen Rocky, so I don't even know if that's what happens. Goodbye.